Hi guys and welcome back to Food Basics Reinvented. If you've recently purchased a carbon steel wok to improve your Asian cooking skills and achieve perfectly charred dishes with delicious flavor, you've made a wise choice. Carbon steel is the best material for making woks because it's lightweight, heats up quickly and imparts a lovely charred flavor to the food. However, it's important to properly season your wok to protect it from rust and make it non-stick. Fortunately, seasoning your wok is an easy process and I'm here to show you how in the next few minutes. So stay tuned and let's get started. When you first receive your carbon steel wok, it will come with a sticky protective film to guard it against rust as carbon steel is susceptible to rusting when exposed to water and moisture. In order to properly season your wok, you'll need to remove this protective coating. To do this, start by heating the wok on high heat for a few minutes until the protective film burns off. You'll know it's ready when the wok turns from silver to a different shade of gray. This indicates that the sticky protective coating has evaporated, leaving you with a naked carbon steel wok ready to be seasoned. Next, clean the wok by adding boiling water and a mild dish soap, and then scrub the wok with a steel mesh or sponge. Try to use a steel mesh if possible, but if you don't have one like me, a regular sponge will work as well. This will help to remove any remaining protective coating and prepare the wok for seasoning. The wok is very hot, so the water I added evaporated quickly. If this happens to you, just add more hot water and dish soap until you have enough to properly clean the wok. To clean the surface of the wok, use a long pair of tongs to hold the sponge and wipe the wok down. Then empty the dirty water and place the wok back on the heat. As the wok heats up, oops, just be careful guys. If your wok doesn't have a flat bottom like this Chinese wok, make sure you grab the handle and hold the wok all the time, or it will fall and might bend, which will break your heart if the wok is new, or might cause damage to your kitchen and put you in trouble with your partner. As the wok heats up, dry it off with a kitchen towel. Now that the wok is clean and dry, it is ready to be seasoned. To season the wok, add a thin film of vegetable oil, such as canola, or any other type of oil that has a high smoke point to the inside and outside of the wok using a paper towel to apply it. When heated, this oil will polymerize and turn into a resin that protects the carbon steel from rust and makes the wok non-stick as a final step and to ensure that the wok is properly seasoned and ready for use. Add some sesame oil or any other vegetable oil you like to use for Asian cooking to the wok and heat it. Then fry some spring onions and ginger in the oil. The spring onions and ginger will absorb any residual protective coating and add an additional layer of protection to the carbon steel wok. When you're finished, discard the fried spring onions and ginger and wipe any excess oil from the wok. This will leave you with a beautifully protected and seasoned Asian wok that is ready for cooking amazing dishes. I hope you found this episode helpful. Please tell me your opinion in the comments below and check out Food Basics Reinvented Facebook and Instagram pages for more tips and amazing recipes. Please subscribe so you don't miss any of my new videos and thank you so much for watching.